Welcome back for another Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth video. Today, I covered four out of the seven new Digimon. So today we're going to do a number five. We are out of starter burst modes. So the next one on the list is... Next one on the Digivolution list here is... Sylphimon could Digivolve into a new Digivolution form. Into... Valkyriemon. The Digivolution requirements are actually much nicer and kinder than the starter Digi burst mode Digimon were. The requirements are you need to be level 50 or higher, 130 attack or plus, intelligence 130 plus, speed 160 plus, and your ability must be above 20. There is no friendship or cam requirement. So this is more of the uh, easier ones to obtain. Sylphimon digivolves into... Valkyriemon. Alright, first impressions. I've actually not been... I have not seen much of Valkyriemon in the Digimon world. My only really uh, experience with Valkyriemon was finding it in Digimon World 3. Aside from that, I have no other prior experience with uh, Valkyriemon. So, going over its actual first uh, first impressions, it has a bird-like shield, it has quivers, it's got a gun on its back, it's got a hawk cape for wings, and it has a sword, which looks like a great sword. It's very interesting. Visors and a hawk cap, and it has a little, uh, I want to guess that's a Fenrir. Moving on. His skill, he has one uh, special move, known as the Fenrir Sword. It's a physical attack, 130 base water damage to one foe. And it has a 15% chance of instantly killing its target. Oh, oh, I could actually see this being spanned very nicely. Its special skill, Freeyar, I think I'm saying it right, Freeyar, increases the damage of wind and light skills by 10%. On top of it being a free type mega class wind attribute Digimon from a Joker's level, I would definitely say this is quite keen on that. It could also be Digivolved from Anjuomon and Magna Anjuomon. So it's not that bad per se. It is quite available, but I chose to Digivolve from Silphimon as, well, it's the natural line. So let's go take a look at Valkyriemon in battle. <laughs> As per usual, I am only using Valkyriemon. Valkyriemon is actually pretty much the same height as an actual teenager human. So that's very nice that they keep the uh, aspect for some of these Digimon relatively the same in the actual regard. Alright, Fenrir Sword. Let's take a look at it. Oh, holy crap. Let's get an instant replay of that. Okay. I now have a new favorite mega level. Yeah. If I didn't have a reason to like Valkyriemon before, this one sold it for me. So, if this sold it for you and you like Valkyriemon even more, now than you did before, leave a comment about it down below. Let others know about your love for Valkyriemon, as Valkyriemon seems to be a pretty underestimated and underused Digimon. So, that's it for this Digimon. I will see you for the next Digimon. If you like this, please like it. And stay subscribed, and stay tuned for the next part for the next Digimon.